What's up everybody? Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good afternoon. Hope you're all doing great. Hope you're all having a great, uh, hope you all had a great week. It's almost over. Uh, but in this video, we'll focus on optimism and, uh, and the OP coin, um, which uh, there's quite a lot to say. Quite a lot to say about the fundamentals of optimism in the last, uh, in the last couple of weeks it has been performing very well. Um, but the last two days, uh, something is going on, which I'm actually not sure what it is. I, I looked through all of uh, all of uh, the news outlets on optimism, but couldn't really find anything. Uh, so we'll talk about that and you'll soon enough know what, what I'm talking about. But overall, optimism is still looking very bullish. We're up about 6.5% of the last 24 hours. Volume compared to the market cap is still amazing. It, uh, it has dropped down a little bit, but that's... Um, that's really not a problem. I mean, before that, we were very volatile, as you can see, due to some news and stuff. Uh, so now we're at, uh, at, at still, as I said, high levels of volume and, uh, and, and we're doing good. As you can also see from the chart, we're still in an uptrend. We struggled a little bit, a uh, little bit the 18th due to some, some, some uh, well, negative news or at least some uh, worrying news. Uh, but we're back up today uh, and, and right now we're testing 1.8 so we'll talk about whether i think we can break that and uh, and get up to our next price target at around 2.05 that's my price target we'll talk about whether i think we can get there or not but uh, first i wanted to take a look at some things regarding the optimism layer 2 blockchain uh, as you can see optimism uh, the daily active ad active addresses uh, has been in an uptrend for quite a long time. Uh, as you can see, the, 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 the network is just doing very well. The daily transactions were in a steep uptrend as well. And what you can then see in the daily active addresses, but also in the daily transactions, is that the last two days it has significantly dropped down. Um, and I'm not sure if this is some sort of a reporting issue or error, or if that there's really something going on. Because if you, for example, and this, this is throughout multiple sources, all right? I, I uh, wanted to make sure that it's not because of Goku stats that they had some uh, trouble with uh, with the sourcing and with the uh, um, retrieving of the data. Uh, no, their own optimism either scan uh, chart also shows that the last two days in uh, in daily addresses has uh, significantly dropped. So I'm not sure what's going on, um, but uh, it's, uh, it's 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 a little bit worrying. Not too much. We'll have to see in the upcoming days how it recovers or if it uh, if it really was just an issue. Um, but apart from that, as you can see, the total value locked ever since the beginning of the year or a little bit later has been growing as well. Right now at around the 600 million, which uh, is seventh of all the uh, of all the block blockchains. I know that uh, from the top of my head. So yeah, fundamentals around optimism are, are pretty bullish. If we take a look at the fundamentals in the market, uh, they're pretty strong as well. Bitcoin is still above 21,000, for example. Uh, so, do I expect that we can reach our price target at $2.05? Yes, I do think so. Uh, obviously, the, the end of the week is nearing and, uh, and in the weekend we don't move a lot. So, this is probably a move for either Sunday evening when we sometimes get some more momentum of volatility or beginning of next week. But for now, what I still expect is that, uh, you know, we might break above 1.8, but then we will not break above 1.9. Um, and I think it's even more likely that we'll just kind of consolidate it's between 1.65 and uh, 1.9 ultimately. And then, as I said, that's somewhere uh, somewhere at the end of the weekend or beginning of next week, we will be able to get enough bullish momentum to break above 1.9, uh, which will get us all the way up to this level right here between $2 and 2.1. But the major resistance level within that is 2.05. Um, so yeah. That's my take on optimism for today and, uh, and, and on, the, on the fundamentals surrounding optimism as well. Uh, if you'd like more updates on optimism, let me know. But for now uh, and for today, this is my take. So take care and uh, thank you for watching and bye.